What's going on everyone? Stealth Wolf here and welcome to a playthrough no one saw coming. Wait, I said that previously. But no, no one saw this coming. No one saw this series coming but me because I thought of it. Welcome to Borderlands Game of the Year Edition 100% hopefully. I say 100%, I have no idea if this is going to be a full 100%. It's going to be all quests. I'm going to try and do all the missions. That does include the DLC. Now, I am aware, I am aware, this is going to be the PS4 version of Borderlands. So, the Borderlands remaster, I guess, for PS4, which is being played on a PS5, because technology... And also, this is the Game of the Year edition. So, people who are slightly nostalgic to the original Borderlands, like me, uh, but have not played all the DLC, this will be a look back with the brilliant cell shaded graphics and the amazing theme, or the amazing opening track to any game. Well, I guess licensed. Yeah, it's pretty good though. So yes, Borderlands, one hundred percent. I hope you do enjoy, and uh, yeah, this is going to be a long old one. You remember Kingdoms of Amalur? That being an RPG, this is kind of a similar thing. Well, because there's RPG elements, but it's a shooter. Ah, uh, yes, I remember. The uh, the dawning of the word RPS, role-playing shooter. This game defined it. This game also defined cel-shaded graphics. I can speak. <laughs> but yes, Borderlands 1. Just this. It's going to be a long one. But hopefully uh, action-packed. I guess a bit more action-packed than... Uh, than Kingdoms of Amalur. There is also going to be a couple of small rules about fast travel. Because leveling up, you can level up quite far, especially with some of the DLCs. Well, with one of the DLCs which managed, you could go up to some high level, I can't remember exactly. So, leveling up is going to be a huge thing, obviously. Um, so, Fast travel is only going to be used occasionally. I'm going to try and keep it occasionally as much as possible just so we can explore the areas and everything like that. We still have to get to locations to use the fast travel. But after that, it would be kind of going back to locations that we've already been to. Or if the game just decides to be a dick and, you know, I die somewhere... And then it respawns me miles away. But there's a fast travel point closer. Do you get what I mean? But uh, yeah. God, 100 What am I getting myself into? Plus the DLC. I played all... I had all the DLC on the original 360 version. The only reason I'm not playing that is because I have the PS4 version. And it looks and runs a lot better. But there was one DLC I never played. And uh, I don't think I'm going to like it. And I don't remember much about the other DLCs apart from a few things. So it's going to be fun. Yay. But I hope you do all enjoy. So thank you all for listening. I hope you're having a good day. And peace out.